I had the honor a while ago uh, to be uh, received by His Excellency President Paul Kagame, and I was honored uh, to present uh, him my credentials as the new appointed Egyptian ambassador to Rwanda, the most uh, brother uh, country, um, and we um, evaluate much our relations with uh, Rwanda. Uh, there's a political will on the Egyptian side to engage and to enhance our bilateral relations in all uh, fields and in different sectors, um, namely the political, the economic, the health sector, um, the, the security and military. Uh, Egypt is willing uh, to cooperate in uh, different fields and to engage uh, more with Rwanda bilaterally and uh, in addition also to the regional and international uh, shared uh, files. Thank you so much for today and looking forward to um, continued cooperation with this uh, lovely country. We are Africa, we share uh, a number of interesting files. Both of us are Nile Basin countries also. I'm very, very honored to be in Rwanda. Having now presented my letters of credence to His Excellency the President of Rwanda. I'm uh, now able to uh, fully engage and advance the good bilateral relationship between Canada and Rwanda. It will be easy for me to do so considering how already well established these relationships are. We will be focusing on of course strengthening the commercial ties between our two countries for that, we also have a large Rwandan diaspora in Canada that we can count on. And we will also have already some companies that are established here in Rwanda that can help promote uh, the environment here as being safe for investment, very dynamic. So this will be one of the sectors that we will be prioritizing. But we also continue to offer uh, in alignment with the priorities of the government some support and, and, um, and, and technical assistance in terms of development priorities in the health sector, in education, in job creation. And we collaborate quite closely with various learning institutions here in Rwanda, the University of Rwanda as one of them. So, so we have a lot on our plate. We're extremely excited at the idea of advancing all of that. And I know that Canada is quite uh, close to the heart of many people in Rwanda. Kenya aims to retain its position as one of Rwanda's top trade partners. Kenya exports to Rwanda foodstuff, beverages, pharmaceutical products, cement, iron and steel products. Where Rwanda, on the other hand, exports to Kenya coffee, tea, horticultural foods, raw hides and skins. The trade volumes in the last uh, years have risen and I look forward to engaging the Rwandan authorities to build on this good relationship built over the years for exchange of goods and services. In, services. Kenya is also the main route for Rwanda's export and import through Kenya port, Kenya's port of Mombasa. While numerous Kenyan companies have found a home here in Rwanda for business opportunities. On bilateral uh, relationships between Kenya and Rwanda, numerous visits have been take, have taken place. Uh, we've had our um, uh, His Excellency, our President, uh, President William Ruto, who visited had a state visit uh, here last year, April 2023, that saw our two great nations signed 10 agreements aimed at enhancing cooperation in several, several areas, including education, ICT, health, gender and child development, youth and capacity development for the public service, as well as correctional services. As a High Commissioner, I will follow up on implementation of the existing cooperation agreements to ensure that they expand